Hi guys, I'm back with another video. And today's video is gonna be my top names for baby boy and baby girl names. <laughs> and we're gonna start with the boy names. I think I only have four. Roman is here, per usual. So my top boy name is Julian. And this name was inspired by Julian McMahon from, uh, some of you guys may know him uh, from Charm. Some of you may know him as, what's his name? Dr. Doom in Fantastic Four, I think is his name, the villain. Um, he's in those two movies. He's also in the movie Premonition with Sandra Bullock. I just really like the name Julian. As I was, I was looking through names for baby boys just because I really liked Roman's name, but I never really found anything else that stuck out. I was looking around because as some of you guys know, you may know from my previous video, I've been trying to conceive. I just really like the name Julian and that's also a J name, like Jasmine. But that's that's really where the name was inspired from, Julian McMahon's name. I like the name Julian. It's really nice. It has a nice, for me, it it's definitely at the top of my list for boy names. So the second name that I have is Phoenix. This one's a little out there and it's almost on the verge of being too unique for um, my liking, but I do like it. Like if I didn't name if I didn't name my son this, I would name my animal this, or like my pet. I really like the name Phoenix. Uh, it makes me think of Joaquin Phoenix. Like, I don't know. I, I saw this in a uh, another YouTuber's video. Her name's Liza Adele. And she, I think, I think it was Liza Adele. I'm gonna have to like do my research. Um, but she put this in hers and I was like, yes. I like that name, Phoenix. Like Roman and Phoenix, Julian and Phoenix. Maybe the third boy name on my list is Donovan, and I don't know where I saw this name. Honestly, it could have been the same girl's video, but I really do like the name Donovan. The first thing I personally think of is Matt Donovan from The Vampire Diaries. He's one of the characters, and uh, yeah, I just I like Donovan a lot. I like Dominic too, but I know a lot of Dominics, so um, Donovan, I like it. Roman and Donovan. I really do like Donovan. I haven't ran any of these by my husband either. So if he watches this, I guess we'll see what he thinks. <laughs> the last name that I have on my boy list is Nolan. I know a girl Nolan, but I don't know any boys named Nolan. Roman and Nolan. Like, I don't know if that's too close, but I think of Christopher Nolan. That's his name, right? Christopher Nolan. And now we're gonna move on to the girl names. And the first at the top of my list, because I already have like the name, laid out her name would be Vera and I love this name I think of uh, I'm gonna butcher her last name but I think of Vera Farmiga she's in so much she is uh she plays Lorraine Warren in the Conjuring movies and uh in Annabelle I think she's in Annabelle too and oh god she's in so many movies you guys she's been around for a while and she's probably one of my favorite actresses. I also think of Vera Wang whenever I say Vera. And if I had a daughter named Vera, more than likely, don't quote me if I end up posting like a pregnancy video in the future if I ever get pregnant. As a nod to my mom, I think I would name, I would name my daughter Vera Michelle Santiago. I just, I like the way it sounds. It sounds like a brand name, Vera Michelle Santiago or Vera Michelle, you know? I really like that. So that's what I would name my daughter. Uh, the second name that I have on my list is Jacqueline, spelled exactly like Jacqueline Hill. Um, I love that spelling in particular. I don't know why. And plus it's another J name. So, you know, <laughs> I really do like the name Jacqueline. I think it's pretty uh, Roman and Jacqueline. Like, I don't know. It's It feels like a strong name to me too. So the third name on my list is Elena. And actually this is the name that I... It was originally at the top of my list. However, it isn't at the top anymore just because we do have some family. Uh, we have a Antonio's cousin, Antonio, my husband. His cousin's name is Elena. And um, I just, I don't know, is that weird? Like having other family members named after something that you want, like having two Elenas in the family, I don't know. But I like this name because of Vampire Diaries. I'm gonna be honest and totally transparent. Thank you. Roman just gave me a wheel. Um, but I really love the name Elena. Like if there was no Elena's in our family, I would absolutely 100% tell my husband, we're naming our daughter Elena. I love that name. It's, I love it. The fourth name on my list is Camila. And no, it's not after Camila. Is it Cabello or Cabello? The singer. 
Um, it's not named after her. It was after uh, Camila, what's her name, from Riverdale. I like that name. And then I also, someone else, someone else's name is Camila. I can't remember who, but I really like that name. Um, it's very girly to me. Anything that ends with A for a girl, I feel like is very girly and feminine. Um, but I really like that name, Camila. It's very, I think my husband would like that too, actually. Not gonna lie. The fifth name I have on my list is Ivy. Um, I don't know why I added this to my list. I might have one day just been looking at my phone and saw Beyonce's daughter, Blue Ivy. And I liked, I like Ivy. It's different. It's kind of like, not mysterious, but it is at the same time. I like, I don't know, Ivy. Ivy, Ivy Santiago. I don't know. It's different. And the last name of this video is Melody. And this, I probably wouldn't name my daughter Melody, um, but it, it'd be fitting. I mean, I like singing. I don't know. Just Melody is a pretty name. It reminds me of The Little Mermaid too, if any of you have seen that movie. The Ariel's daughter's name is Melody. And I just, I really like it. Melody. I don't know anyone named Melody. So, so there you have it. That is my baby names list for 2020. Uh, I hope that eventually one day I can use one of these names. Um, hopefully it's in the next year. What I do when I'm picking them out, I try to find a happy medium between like a super white name like Jonathan or uh, David and uh, a very Hispanic name because like, you know, we want like both sides of the family to like pronounce it. And then we also want like it to suit what the child looks like so we always try to find that happy medium and with our first son roman that's what i think we found his name's roman noel i think i did pretty good in picking out these names i haven't run them by my husband let me know what you think of the names that i picked out let me know what's on your baby name list and if you have any suggestions for names i am more than happy to be open to those names and comment your ideas down below i still have this wheel thing on my finger but thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.